What up guys? Um, here to make another team build video. Uh, last team build I did was Fabway. And um, this new build I basically just put together and it works really well. It's very good for vanquishing. And I didn't really give it a name, I just kind of slapped it together. So, um, let me show you the uh, teams, or the builds. Alright. Um, here we go. The first per the person has to be a writ, because the objective is two writs, two necros. So the the player has to be a writ, and you're gonna run a signet of spirits build bar with um basically just it's basically the the spirit signet of spirits farm with summon spirits and a res. I like we shall return because it reses the entire party. Um. But for the skills, it's Signet of Spirits, Shadow Song, Blood Song, Vampirism, Pain, Painful Bond, and then Summon Spirits and a res of your choice, but I like We Shall Return. And the uh, Ritualist Hero build is... Oop. Crap. What did I have in there? One second, guys. Sorry. Well, actually, yeah, that's what I did have. This, um, this option, this slot is optional. So basically you have Boon of Creation, Soul Twisting, um, Armor of Unfeeling to keep the spirits alive, Union, Shelter, Displacement, and a res. Um, this bar basically keeps your party alive. It, um, provides, uh, a protection-like build for your party. And you can fill in a number of skills with uh, with this build uh, for that extra spot. Disenchantment's good, uh, depending on where you're going. Just before you're vanking, scout out what the enemies have, and then just use that um, optional slot accordingly. Uh, I think I'm just going to slap on Vital Weapon. It's a nice little boost. Um, alright. Whether or not the hero uses it well enough or not. Uh, for the next is, uh, your first necro. Master of Whispers I always use. It's just a standard, um, uh, MM bar, minion master bar. I like to use Aura of Lich. Now, I suggest that, well, actually, in fact, you need to have barbs, and Putrid Bile is, um, nice. Also, depending on where you're going, infused condition it could be very, very helpful because it basically takes the uh, conditions off you. So that's just the, the, that build. And then the last one is just your standard uh, necro ritualist healer and uh, just zin rays, weapon of warden, uh, men, body, and soul, spirit light, protective laws, coli, life, and you can put whatever. Uh, healing spirit you want in there. Uh, Signal of Lost Souls for energy management and a res. So, now let's go and see how this build works. Alright, so, here we are right outside of Port Sledge in Whitman's Foley. And just to show you how awesome this build is, I'm g doing this without henchmen. And I've actually, sol I've actually vanquished this area without henchmen. So, yeah, it's a pretty good build. Okay, and also guys, for um, Xandra, uh, when I was going over the build, I put in Vital Weapon, but I replaced that with Doom, because that's a large spike of, um, does a lot of damage, so, yeah, uh, that's what I did, but you can put whatever you want in there. Alright. So remember when you're vanking or doing any type of general PvE, call your targets and that will um, allow your henchmen to um, spike better. That will let your henchmen spike better. It's just a lot better. Um, so yeah, the main purpose is just to lay your spirits, call your target. And pretty much your your heroes will do the rest of the work. You don't even need to micromanage, to be honest. Um, and this.
this is a very very nice build. You could, heck, you could run, you you could run a lot of things with this. Now the one downfall which I did right now is over aggroing. I'm more than likely gonna die here. If I don't, it's amazing. Um, but just be careful with over aggroing with this build. Yeah, look at all these girls. I'm dead. Alright. Maybe not. I mean, I can solo all these guys. But, uh... I guess that's another good part of this build. If you're vanking, you can just... straight up... solo. Ooh, not enough energy. Yeah, so I died there. But that's my fault. That that just kind of showcases a flaw of this build. So it's kind of a good thing that I died. Don't over aggro like I did. Look at all those enemies. Um, so yeah, just be careful of that. Plus, if you're vanking, you're gonna have henchmen with you or another teammate. So that wouldn't have happened. You would have been able. You would have definitely been able to survive that. So unless you're going out on a four-man team, just don't over aggro. I guess is what I'm trying to say. So alright, let's call our targets. Ooh, lag. Let's go. Alright, tag this guy. Come on. One of the reasons I spanked this area was for the uh, the get the Nicholas the Traveler is taking intricate Grawl necklaces, but it's kind of over now. By the time you see this video, it's probably gonna be too late, but yeah. So, that's pretty much it. Sorry I haven't been able to get uh, videos up lately, I've been very busy um, with work and tennis and stuff. So, just destroy a few more girls here. Yeah, so, um, I think what I've decided to do is maybe do some, like, mission guides. Because there's only so much I can farm, you can farm in the game. I might do, like, a, uh, I don't know. I might think of, um, ways to run missions, and then do a guide on it. Like, I've been tweaking a build around to run, um, Napu Quarter, or Napu Quarter. And if you can run that, you can. I, I've seen people run that for 5k uh, a person. So, I mean, I've also seen someone run it for 1k a person. So, don't quote me on that. But that's a good place to run because there's a lot of people that hate that mission. And there's a lot of people who are willing to pay for that mission. So, um, anyway, I just kind of got sidetracked. But if you guys think I should do like mission guides or something like that, or just continue these uh, uh, build guides. Leave a comment. Also, I've been having a major problem with my sound. I'm sure you guys can tell. But yeah, I really hope to get that resolved before I do more more videos because it's just kind of a problem for me. Uh, it just doesn't sound good, and I don't like that. Uh oh, we might over aggro again. So yeah, uh, I might, the sound might be better on this, because I might know what the problem is, but I'm not sure, so don't count on it. Alright, just because I want to freaking use We Shall Return, I'm going to try and get rolled here. Oh, okay. Darn it. Anyway, on that note, um, that's it for this guide. I hope you enjoyed it. Please know that this actually does work. Just because I died twice doesn't mean that you can't bank because you, you'll have henchmen or another teammate with you when you bank and this is gonna definitely keep you alive and roll enemies. So thanks uh, for watching and I'll see you in the next video.